climate change is real and it's upon us to reduce our contribution to the global emissions in order to save the mother earth. Even though it is very difficult to reverse all the damage done by global warming, we believe it's an architect's job to lead and be the change we so desperately need. Buildings alone contribute 40% of the global carbon emissions. We as aspiring architects in the modern world put a way forward for an office building that is not only net zero energy and water, but is also a carbon negative building in total. With this, we present to you Visa Zero, a net zero office building designed for a rice mill in Karnal district of Haryana. The challenging site has air and noise pollution from both the plant's heavy machinery and frequent traffic. Our group Sparikam managed to provide a healthy and productive office environment by implementing site-responsive passive strategies. Using a hybrid structure, we reduced the use of RCC while increasing the use of carbon-negative materials like CLT and agrocrete, which assisted in making the building overall carbon-negative. In other words, our building will trap CO2 from the environment rather than emitting it itself. Further, the waste heat from the boilers was utilized to run the vapor absorption chiller system, thus reducing the cooling demand and drastically bringing down the EPI to 17 kilowatt hour per meter square per year. Team Sparicum was concerned with the ongoing water shortages in Karnal due to excessive use of water for irrigational purposes and we managed to bring down the water consumption by 45% using water efficient fixtures and grey water recycling practices. Further, 72% of the annual water demand was met by using harvested rainwater. Unlike a modern day office building, where we have air conditioning at all places and the occupants are left with no option but to go along with it. The design offers a choice for the occupants to work in an air conditioned environment or to work in a naturally ventilated area. Also to encourage people towards using more of renewable energy, the front facade has solar panels integrated into it. Rather than being placed entirely on the roof, making it visible to the people moving down the streets and inspiring them to use more of renewable energy sources, thereby setting a trend for using more of renewable energy and relying less on air conditioning.